Chao. We consider a discrete time model described by the sequence given here. So this example is a, a typical example to show a chaotic behavior. So it looks simple, but we'll see that the behavior of the dynamical system is very complex. So x of k here is uh, the population size, in, for instance, in millions of uh, inhabitants, and k is the number of the year. So this model has uh, two effects. First, as we will see uh, on the picture, the growth of the population increases exponentially when uh, the size is small, when we have few inhabitants. And then, when we are too many, more than uh, the theoretical carrying capacity of the environment, then the population starts to decrease. Uh, from this, uh, the first question is uh, we need to find the equilibrium points for this. So, what I propose first is to draw this picture and to understand uh, why uh, the link with uh, the growth and starvation process. So I will start with uh, a program of the function f and I will draw this function. So I will draw the function uh, I will uh, first build uh, a vector x so x will be a, a long vector starting at uh, 0 and then 0 0.001 then 0 0.002 and so on up to 1 one, I start with zero with a sampling time of 0 0.01. Then, from this vector, I will apply the function f. Recall that I want to study xk plus 1 equal f of xk, where f is here. And also, as a comparison, I will draw the identity. Okay. If I do this, I switch to Python. I start my program and I can see this picture. So here I represent xk, here it's xk plus 1 and the plane xk, xk plus 1 is called the uh, point carré uh, uh, plane. Assume for instance that, uh, so here in red is a function f. Assume that I start with a population which is uh, uh, small, so around zero, let's say uh, uh, 0 0.2. Okay. So if at, I am at 0 0.2 here, then we can understand that f will be like this, okay, and if I want uh, here, it will correspond to xk plus 1. So here, let's say it's x at, at the year number 0. Here, it's x at time 1, at year 1. Then I come back to the xk space. Here. And this corresponds here to x1. So at the beginning, the population is small. So when it is like this, we can see that x1 is bigger, greater than x0. So it will always be the case when there is few inhabitants. But when we have we are too many inhabitants, then we can see that x at time k uh, at your k plus one is smaller than at your uh, than at your number k. It's just a model, just to, to, to give an interpretation of this system. So if I continue like this, I will have something like this. So here it's x at your 2 and I come back. Here 
x at your two and I will do some kind of thing like this picture like this and we can understand on this picture that for here and here we have an equilibrium point so it means if at time k I'm here at time k plus 1 I will be here it means that I am here also so x k plus 1 so I have two equilibrium points because I have an intersection between the curve which corresponds to identity and the function f now I can compute this I can check this so to check this I have to solve x equal f of x and for such a x I will have x k plus 1 equal f of x k so it corresponds to an equilibrium so it means that x equal to 4x multiplied by i minus x and the first solution is x equals 0 you can understand that if x equals 0 both uh, right, and, uh, right hand side and left hand side are both equal to 0 so now if uh, x cannot be equal to 0 I can simplify like this here I will obtain a 1 and I obtain x equal 3 divided by 4 so it corresponds to the solution I have just found previously this corresponds to this and that corresponds to this equilibrium point second question how many cycle with the length 3 so it means that x at time k plus 1 should be equal to x at time k uh, can I find so of course I have to avoid the, uh, the equilibrium point that can be seen as cycle with a length equal to 1 for this of course I can compute it but we can easily see that uh, the computation will not be so easy and a graphic resolution could be used for this purpose and it is what we will do I propose the following program I still have my function f and I will program a function f o f o so the composition of n function f and this one if f power a if I have i times or I'm function f so it means I can define as follows f f1 is equal to f and f power a plus 1 is a composition of f with f power i it is what I have defined here recursively so if i equal to 0 I return the identity so it's not exactly this identity so f of x power 0 it's equal to 1 and uh, of uh, I don't to x excuse me and I still have f power on of x equal f of x as said previously then I will uh, draw f1 f2 f3 in different colors and I still draw the identity for comparison given here and this one corresponds also to fi of x 0 okay I switch to Python I start the program and I can see this picture okay so we can see here our function f1 or f I can see also the function f2 and I can also see the function f3 which is equal to f or f composition of f and this one 
equal to f compose with itself twice only. I can see here here and here the fixed point. So it means that f of x is equal to uh, x equilibrium point. Now I can see so uh, like here and here the point such that f of f of x is equal to x. Now in blue here 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 and here so one two three four five six I have three uh, 6f such that f o f o f of x equal to x and this corresponds to a limit uh, uh, limit cycle of length 3 if x0 is here then here I will have x1 x1 and here it will be f which maps x0 into x1 here I will have x2 I come back x2 so it means that here my function f maps x1 into x2 and I continue and I see that I come back to x so it means that here I come back to x0 by f so if I, I have a cycle of 1 plus 1 plus 1 so it means that in this example f3 of x0 is equal to x0 Last question, we have to provide a simulation which shows that uh, the system has a chaotic behavior. I propose the following Python program. I have my function f. Uh, I draw uh, the, uh, my function and I will start at x0 equal 0.2 so it will correspond to this point so here is the value of f I compute here y which corresponds to f of x then I will draw this segment so I will start to xx so it xx corresponds to this point x then after it's xy, so xy corresponds to this point, and this will draw this segment here. Then I will draw y, y which corresponds to this point, and here it corresponds to x1 from x0, and I will continue up to 100. So I will have this, and this, and this and so on. I will continue. I switch to Python, I run the program and we can see that I obtain such a picture which is not so easy to interpret. So again, if I go to 100 to 1000 say, I can see that I uh, I feel uh, almost all the planes that are uh, below the parabola or on the right. We can see also that if I start from another point, let's say uh, 0 0.9 or what I want, I do the same and I will obtain the same picture. Okay, so it will, for almost all x, it will be the same except, for instance, if I take a 0 or 
uh, 0.75 let's say I will take for instance here 0.75 just to check if I have no numerical instability due to floats which should not be the case here so I obtain nothing because I have only one point okay it is due to the fact that 0.75 is representable in machine so the chaotic behavior does not occur here the exact ans answer of 0.75 is computed at each time if I had a small perturbation like this and if I run the program I will see as previously the same kind of picture so you can see that there is some so how can I check uh, the, uh, the behavior uh, why we have a chaotic behavior so I will take here 0.2 for instance so I can have taken something else and I will take two different conditions like this x2 equal now I will print uh, uh, let's say so a small error like this for instance then I will take uh, x1 minus x2 and probably less than 1000 let's say uh, 100 I will compute this one and also here this one and the other one I will do also like this so one one two 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 here red okay and I will run the program so here I show the error if I start then I can see the two pictures look the same but I will see the error at the beginning the error is almost zero but slowly and slowly in it's increasing and after a while zero it can be anything between uh, m uh, minus one and plus one so if, if here I draw the picture I can see that indeed the behavior between the two trajectories are the same but the error is uh, is huge even if I start with a very small error so this illustrates the chaotic behavior of my system.